guys, this video is geared to all Orange County and Southern California investors, those that own rental property here in Southern California. I've been getting a question over and over, emailed and texted to me from lots of my clients. Hey, we've got a prop rental property, but I know the market is changing. Should we keep it? Should we sell it? You know, what should we do? Should we move our, our money out of California? You know, and here's what I'm telling all of my great clients. After a lot of research, I've really found that there are two types of rental properties. Those you should keep, and those I really do think you should get rid of uh, pretty quickly. The ones that I think you should keep are gonna be your cash cows that you've owned a long time, have good tenants in them, and don't have any upcoming maintenance issues, right? Those homes that you don't have to put on a new roof, put on a new uh, main drain line, put on a new electrical panel, or completely remodel the property. Those homes that are in really good condition, that are in really good neighborhoods, and are um, giving you a great profit because um, the tenant's paying great rent, those obviously should keep. That's a no-brainer. However, there's a lot of you out there that have rental properties where the roof is about to go and you're gonna need to spend $25,000 on a new roof. Your main drain line is gonna need replacing. That's $7,000 to $10,000. You know, you're gonna to need to remodel a kitchen or redo an electrical panel. Some of these big, what we call capital expenditures, um, those, are some, those are homes that I think you should probably consider getting rid of while the market is still strong. And it is still strong, right? Because when this market starts to change in the fall, what I think you're gonna see is prices are gonna decrease a little bit and if prices are coming down and yet you've got to spend twenty, thirty, fifty thousand dollars to keep up these rental properties, eh, I think it's you know maybe a time to sell. Also, homes that are uh, th those headache homes where you have tenants that are not great, um, where you're never going to get great tenants, those homes in B and C class neighborhoods, those I would really consider getting rid of now before this market starts to change. But if you've got something that is doing well for you, being very profitable, keep it, keep it, keep it. You know, Orange County real estate long-term is gonna be very healthy. All right, guys, uh, as always, if you have questions, like and subscribe below, and I'll be happy to answer any questions you have. Thanks.